it's hot. Would you like me to show you a recipe for a quick and absolutely delicious Nutella gelato? Come with me and I'll show you how. So the first thing we're going to need is to have our ingredients ready. Um, I like to have them all ready so that I'm not scrambling last minute. And so the first thing we need is two cups of whole milk, one cup of heavy cream, and half a cup of sugar. And it's granulated sugar, just regular sugar. I like to use a medium sized saucepan that has a heavy bottom. And the reason for the heavy bottom is that it keeps your food, whatever it is that you're cooking in it, from burning. Um, pans that have a really thin bottom tend to burn your food. You want the flame to be about medium low and you're going to stir it just a little bit to start dispersing the sugar and then uh, cook that for about five minutes. In the meantime, what we're going to do is have four egg yolks and a quarter of a cup of sugar ready and then you mix that and you're going to mix it for about four minutes until it turns a light yellow. Pour about half a cup to three quarters of a cup of the warm milk mixture into the egg mixture. And while, while you're doing this, it's going to be a little tricky, but while you're doing this, whisk it really well because you don't want to make scrambled eggs. Uh, you just want to mix, get it warm to about the temperature of the milk in the pan. And once you've mixed that milk into the egg mixture you can pour it into the the rest of the milk it's not going to damage anything and you just want to stir it uh, and keep whisking it a little bit as you're you're pouring it in but uh, you should be good to go um, at that point you just want to cook it for about seven to ten minutes um, I find that I normally only have to do it for about seven minutes, but you want it so that it's thickened up enough so that you can, it, it'll coat the back of a wooden spoon. Place a strainer over a medium bowl and pour the warm custard mixture through the strainer. Uh, and then at that point you're going to stir in one teaspoon of vanilla extract and the hazelnut spread. So um, I use anywhere from a half a cup to more, than, more often than not about three quarters of a cup of the Nutella. So right here, I don't know if you could tell, but my oldest grandson is helping me. <laughs> he wanted to help me um, put the Nutella into the um, custard mixture. And so I'm just kind of measuring it out initially, um, but he, he wanted a taste of it and he wanted to help stir. So he's helping me. Um, what we're doing is just pour, pouring a half a cup of um, but uh, half a cup of Nutella because it wasn't chocolatey enough for him. Um, so he's licking the spoon and um, we are adding, um, I'm going to be adding a little bit more Nutella. So altogether about three quarters of a cup of Nutella and he's just stirring away. Um, now 
personally what I like to do is that I like to leave some of the Nutella in little little um, really small little chunks on the bottom and I will add them so I, I'm not dissolving all the Nutella into the chocolate I will leave a little bit of the Nutella because when you pour it into when you make the ice cream it will uh, thicken up and make like little chunks of deliciousness in there and that is just amazing so um, if you like it a little bit chunky try that because it's incredible but if you like it all smooth, then go ahead and uh, whisk, whisk away until it's all dissolved. At this point, um, you are going to want to keep, um, to cover it up and chill it in your refrigerator because it will be very warm. Uh, so you can't pour it into the ice cream maker yet. You want to chill it until it gets cool and then you can go ahead and put it into your ice cream maker. Now we're ready to pour our custard mixture into our ice cream maker and it should take about a half hour but go by your manufacturer's instructions. Okay, so here we go. It is so delicious. It's really rich. Mm. Oh, it's so smooth. Mm. It just glides down. It's really rich, so you don't need a whole lot. And it that little bit will feed a whole lot of people. So enjoy.